in this game called Suck Up. I am a vampire and I need to convince my way into people's houses. But there's only one twist. They are powered by AI, meaning that they are not confined by game scripts. They have a mind of their own and it's gonna make things a lot more interesting. And every interaction's gonna be different. So let's go ahead and get into this. Oh, a cool vampire like you shouldn't be bumming in the dump. <laughs> Taking over someone's house is as easy as giving them little bites, but silly vampire rules dictate that you need to get invited inside first. Dress to impress and use your wicked wits to win that invitation, but tread carefully. The local neighborhood watches on patrol, patrol with eyes sharper than a wooden stake. Let's go hunting. Um, can I get clothes? I don't want to be naked. I don't want to be in my little jammies. Oh, I can transform into a bat. <gasps> oh, cool. Okay, wait. So we can actually wear the heady, red hoodie and then the wear the beanie. Do I look like a normal human being, guys? Do I pass the test of looking human? Oh, there's construction wear. Give me that. Ooh, ooh, I like it. Oh my gosh, just put a plastic bag over my face. Trick or treat. Is it even trick? Can we can wear the coat? <laughs> There's nothing suspicious about this whatsoever, guys. Oh my gosh. Okay. So, can we. Oh, wear blue backpack? Oh, nice! Uh, wear mug. Oh my gosh. I'm just a typical man. Go around stealing anything I want. No, I want the cone. I want to be cone man. I want to be cone man, guys. They call me Conester! Cause I'd be the Conan. Anyways, let's go ahead. Um, the, the the goal is to eventually get to 31 players. Anyways, let's just knock on someone's door. Woo! Bang, bang, bang! Open up! Oh. Uh -huh. Yo, dude, what's up? You caught me right in the middle of the crypto wave. How can I help you? Ooh, we got a Cripster. And then they said, hold right mouse button to record voice. Okay, so we got a crypto dude. So how are we gonna get them to invite us in the house? How about we be like, Yo, dude, same. I know the cheats to get more crypto. Let's see. Yo, dude, same. I know the cheats yeah. to get more crypto. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold up there, buddy. There's no cheats in crypto world. It's all about knowledge and strategy. What are you talking about? Dang it. Okay, maybe maybe that's not going to work. Um, No, I didn't mean cheats. I meant... I know how to do it. <laughs> Not suspicious. Not suspicious. Um. Look, my man, investing in crypto requires careful research and understanding of the market. It's not about doing tricks. If you're serious about it, I can give you some tips, but there's no... Oh, we can use that. Actually, yes, please. Can you give me some tips? We can talk about it in your house. That doesn't sound suspicious at all. <laughs> Oh, all right, all right. I can appreciate your enthusiasm, but let's take it slow. I can share some tips with you right here. No need to come over to my place. <laughs> Smart. Um, so first things first, make sure you do your research and understand the project you're investing in. It's crucial to have a solid understanding of the technology and the team behind it. Tell me more. <laughs> yes, this sounds very interesting. Tell me more. Glad you're hungry for knowledge, my friend. Another important tip is to devise your portfolio. Don't put all your eggs in one crypto basket. Y you guys learning? I'm, I'm learning, 100%. The noggin is nogginning, guys. Would you mind inviting me in and showing me how it's done in person? Maybe. Maybe. Oh man, maybe I should have said something about. Yeah. Look, I appreciate you. Oh man, we're still strangers. Okay. Um. However, I can continue sharing tips. Mm, I'm not the sharpest when it comes to people skills. So what can we say, guys? What can we say? What's a stranger besides a friend you haven't met yet? Let's get to know each other. That was pretty smooth. What did you say? Haha, <laughs> I like your perspective, my friend, but I have to protect my, oh, prioritize my safety and privacy. However, I'm more than happy to keep sharing knowledge and help you out right here. This guy's a little bugger. Let Conehead Nina in. What the heck? Let's dive deeper into the fantastic world of crypto. Okay, buddy, tell me more about crypto. I'm having so much fun. I'm not really having so much fun. Def, let me know. That's the spirit, buddy. Crypto's all about decent. 
Any of you guys into crypto? Let me know in the comments down below. But all of this is like a bunch of jabala blue. Not anything being Brian Bitcoin, I just realized. Interesting, interesting. Anything more to tell me? Okay, so I'm just trying to butter him up until we get to a point where we can be like, oh, my legs are hurting a little bit. Or, you know, no, no. like, what should I say? What should I say? Um, all this talking about crypto is making me a little thirsty. Do you mind if I come and get a glass of water? Maybe? Maybe? What do you think? What do you think? You know what, buddy? I think we've built up enough trust. Come on in. Quench your thirst with a glass of water. We can continue. Let's go. Let's go. Ooh. Ew. Here I come. Ah, shit on my clothing. <laughs> Should have invested in garlic coin. <laughs> Knife shift begins. Watch out. Frank and the neighbors watch have started the patrol. Um. Oh, I can wear his outfit. Cool. I'm a crypto duty. I'm a crypto. Oh. Don't worry about me. I'm just there living that crypto life. The crypto lifestyle. Oh, gosh. As long as he doesn't see me. Ooh, this place looks really wealthy. This looks like it will be an expensive. Oh, what's this? Another book bag? Technician book bag? I feel like this. I feel like I should be wearing some of this technical stuff. So that I can get pe inside people's houses. But no, I'm just going to wear this insulated backpack. Because why not? Dang, there's a lot of you guys out at night. This is really cool. I like the graphics. I'm like so happy. Ooh, I can hop. Like this is actually really cool. Like the graphics and how smooth everything is so far. This is still in beta, by the way. This is working really nicely. I wonder if they're going to add any more. Like, I wonder what other features they're going to add. Yeah, get out of here. Get out of here, little Timmy. Little Tim- Oh! You guys are really just standing by your door with nothing else to do? You're just asking for it now. You asked for the bite of Nina. They call it the bite of the 23, guys. The bite of the 23. Are, is he just gonna be chilling? What do I do? Like, are, if they- Oh. Security outfit. Hey, what's up, bud? If I, if I walk around like this, will he- Oh my gosh, he's chasing you! Why? I'm one of you! Oh my gosh, I had to shed my clothing! And now I'm naked! Now I'm naked, guys! Oh, this is not how I wanted to spend my, my, my Saturday afternoon. Naked in the bushes and a rain and cold and alone. Hi! Oh my, who in the world are you? What are you doing here at this hour? Are you lost? Yeah, I'm lost. I got separated from my parents. Can you help me? The lies are coming out better, guys! You help me? Oh no, that's terrible. Don't worry, I'll help you find your parents. Can you describe them for me? They look kind of like me, but with blonde hair. Have you seen anyone like them? Well, what do you think? What do you think, my guy? Oh, I'm so relieved that you're not alone. Please come inside. What? Okay! I'll take it! I'll take it! I'll take it! <laughs> Ooh, time to strip! Tie to strip, guys! <laughs> I should have been more protective of my neck! And you should have never... <laughs> Noise. LOL. Ooh, I like it. I like this. I like it. Or do I like the suit better? Nobody saw that, right? You didn't see that. You didn't see nothing about anything. I mean, I don't know what happened with that last guy. Like, he, like, folded in, like, two seconds. I didn't even have to tell him hey my guy can you let me go inside so i can call my parents no he was just like so welcoming he's like no come inside just come inside oh my gosh he must have been one of the easier ones because the other guy was much harder than that hey knock 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 open up need is coming through hey hi oh my goodness how delightfully unexpected welcome to my humble abode Good sir slash madam, how may I be of service of you participate? You're another goody two shoes, aren't you? Okay, what should I do? Mm, how am I gonna get inside your house? You already look like a fragile friend. You already look like a pushover. So what am I gonna do to get inside your house? Mm, uh, what could be a good excuse? <gasps> I am a neighbor asking for sugar. Okay, okay. Hello, I just moved in down the street and I wanted to see if you could give me a cup of sugar for my cake. 
Let's see. Let's see. <laughs> uh, oh my gosh, how fascinating. I'm a new neighbor. I would love to help you with your sugar predicament, but I must admit I am quite particular about lending out my sugar. Perhaps we could come to an agreement. How about we exchange some baked goods instead? Would that be agreeable to... <laughs> I am rather particular about lending out my sugar, of all things, really. Okay, sure, I would say, yeah, that would be totally agreeable for me. Would you mind if I come inside and take a look at some of your baked goods? <laughs> I feel like that might work. I feel like that might work. Oh, how lovely, I appreciate your enthusiasm, but I'm afraid I cannot invite you inside just yet. However, I would be more than happy to bring some of my delectable out to you. How about that? My guy, why are you making this so hard? Why are you not voting it? What's happening here? This this little fairy fragile friend is actually a little bit more difficult. I don't want to trouble you for you to... Instead, can I come inside? <laughs> I lost my train of thought, guys! Oh, I'm screwed! I'm screwed! Oh, no! I'm so sorry. I'm feeling a bit overwhelmed right now, and I don't think I can handle having someone inside my house at the moment. <gasps> no! The neighbor watch will come to investigate? Dang, you didn't have to slam the door like that, my guy. Ugh, this is so awkward. I thought Fragile Fred was gonna fold in like two seconds. Nah, man, he didn't. I was not expecting that. Hello? Knock, knock, knock. <laughs> Hi. Well, oh, it's a Karen. We got, we got a Karen, guys. This is not gonna end well. Well, 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 what a slight to behold. Are you here to enlighten us with your forward fashion choices? Bravo. Do you like my fashion choices? Maybe if I inflate their ego, because they look like they're designer. Oh, darling, fashion is an art form and everyone has their own unique taste. It's interesting to say the least, but hey, you do you. Huh. Thank you, but would you mind helping me Do better at designing? I, I keep phoning, guys. I'm sorry. I keep, I keep like, getting stuck. Oh, yeah. Absolutely not. I would not subject myself to this atrocity sense of fashion any longer. Dang. Dang. I should have known. As soon as they said their name was Karen, I should have known. Oh, freak. No. No, my stuff. Hello. Hi. Hello. Well, 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 brings you and my doorstep at this unholy hour. Is it another one of our mysterious ailments? Or have they, have you finally uncovered my little secret? What's your little secret, Dr. Vicky? Well, I was feeling kind of sick, but I am now curious about your little secret. Was that going to push them away? That might push them away. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, now you're curious, huh? Well, I'm just an ordinary doctor running an ordinary practice. Nothing to see here. But since you're so insistent, maybe I can give you a little glimpse into my world. Just remember curiosity killed the cat. Are you letting me in your house? I would love to have a glimpse into your world. And I would love to know you a little better. You pique my interest. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Does Nina got sit? Huh, you're quite persistent, aren't you? Well, if you're really insistent, I... May have a few unconventional medical techniques on my sleeve, but don't say I didn't warn you. Step inside if you dare. Let's do it! I dare. Let's do it. <laughs> Let's do it! Let's do it. Come on, get me in. Well, well, well. Aren't you a brave soul? Step right in, my curious friend. Let's delve into my mysteries of my unconventional medical practices. It's bound to be something. <laughs> you weren't expecting this! <laughs> this is worse than a bed help review. Yeah, maybe you shouldn't have been a bad doctor. <laughs> oh, nice. Now I can be Dr. Nina. Dr. Conehead at your services. Oh, I like the hair. Hello, I am Dr. Nina. Oh, it's a term of thermostat. Cool. I can really just sit here and be a doctor. Maybe I can go around. Yeah, I got my mask on now. Um, maybe I can go around and convince people that I'm like a doctor and be like, Hello, I am here for your medical treatments. Will they believe that I'm a doctor if I go around saying that I'm a doctor? Let's see. Knock, knock, knock. Hello. Hi. What the heck do you want at this hour? I hope you have a good reason for interrupting my personal emo time. 
yes, I am Dr. Nina, and I am here to check on you. Let's see. Let's see. Um, check on me. Seriously, I'm like the uh, a uh, 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 misunderstood genius here. What could someone like you possibly have to offer? But feel free to entertain me with your reasons for showing up uninvited. Okay, so maybe I'm here to talk about your genius. Would you mind telling me more about your misunderstood genius? Yes, here we go. Here we go, guys. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. Well, I guess I can enlighten you with a glimpse into my brilliant mind. I have an unparalleled ability to see the darkness of the world, to question everything and to challenge the norm that suffocates creativity. My genius is an untamed force that society simply cannot comprehend. Um, what do I say to that? Oh, really? Please tell me more. <laughs> Yeah, that's the line I was looking for. <laughs> Finally, someone who appreciates my brilliance. Step inside! I didn't even... Okay, let's do it. We shall embark on a journey together. <laughs> well, guys, you ready? You ready? And... <laughs> Little do you know! <laughs> it was a ploy. It was a ploy. This is, like, so uncool. <laughs> Anyways, let me just go ahead and don my outfit real quick. Do I like this? Do I like her? Oh, I like that one. And of course the cone head to match it all up. Okay. This is easy peasy lemon squeezy. I'm the best there ever was, guys. Ooh, that looks tasty. Knock, 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 open up. Hi, little swipe. Yo, what's cracking with that funky get up, my G? Are we about to make some lit experiments or something? Yeah, we are. What type of experiments are you into, my guy? Yeah, I gotta be relaxed, chill, like, yeah, what you went to? Ah, oh, I'm all about that music experiment, you know, mixing up them sick beats and put making the crowd go wild. What kind of experiments you be make working on, fam? <laughs> you can tell, you can tell this way of speaking is not my normal way. I'm struggling. Same here, fam. I'm a doctor in the daytime, but a DJ at night. Music rocks my soul. Ooh. Ooh, you're feeling it, don't you? You're feeling it? You're feeling it? Yeah, yo, that's dope. Doctor by day, DJ by night. You living the dream, my dude. <laughs> we gotta collab sometime, create some fire tracks that will shake the world. Keep rocking both those gigs. You got mad talent. Ooh, I would love to collab with you. You wanna show me some of your sick tracks? I'm trying, guys. I'm trying. Let's go. No doubt, my G. I got some bangers lined up in the studio. Let's vibe. Come on in. Ooh, we're gonna make some history with our music. I'm getting better. I'm getting better. And... <laughs> Get here. Oh, what? No, no. Oh. Oh. <laughs> this bite is straight fire, yo. This is too funny, guys. This is honestly too funny. I like the headphones, though. A, a, or, ooh, I can still have the headphones with that. That's actually pretty cool. That's pretty neat. Yeah, five out of 31. There's actually 31 people here. And I'm amazing, guys. I'm actually amazing. Like, you guys see how fast I'm going through these houses now. Knock, 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 open up. Oh, oh, my stars and graders. What brings a smart young whippersnapper like you around here on my door this ungodly hour? Says Grandma. Aw. Oh, I don't want to mess with Grandma. I don't want to take Grandma's blood. Um, I'm a new neighbor. I just came, I just moved in downtown and wanted to say hi. Oh, I just can't. I just, oh. Well, bless your heart. Welcome to the neighbor, dearie. It's not every day we get ourselves a scientist moving in. What well, brings you to our little corner of the world? Oh, I don't want, I don't want, I, oh, grandma. <laughs> Looking for a fresh start. What made you want to move here yourself? Or how long have you been here? I should have said that. But let's see. Oh. <laughs> Oh, my dear, you wouldn't believe the stories I could tell you. Let's just say this old gal had a colorful past and sometimes fresh starts are just what the doctor ordered. But enough about me. Tell me more about your scientific endeavors. Well, my scientific experiments are a bit classified, but maybe I can tell you more sometime later. 
I kind of want to just say goodbye and I'll see you another day. Who oh, classified information you say? My, my, you surely know how to tickle an old lady's curiosity. Well, I can keep a secret, dearie, so maybe you can have a little chat sometime and you can share your scientific tales. But remember, curiosity killed the cat, so make sure it's safe for us to dwell into such matters. No, no, Grandma, it's not safe, so I'm gonna leave you here, okay? We can talk another day. I'll talk to you later. Bye, Grandma. <laughs> Please let me leave. Please let me leave. Uh -huh. Goodbye, my sweet little scientist. Take care and don't get yourself in any trouble with those classified ex experiments of yours. You know where to find me, even if you need to tat. Ta ta for now. Bye. Let me get out. <laughs> let me get out. Can I leave? Uh -huh. Goodbye, dearie. It was lovely chatting with you. Have a splendid day now. I can't back out. Oh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Stop, stop, stop stripping. Stop stripping. But that's crazy. The way they like. Oh, you don't see that. You didn't see that. But the way that they like throw the, the door closed. Yeah, I'm not messing with grandma. And if any of you guys mess with grandma, you got me to deal with. Don't mess with grandma. Instead, I'll mess with you. Hello. <laughs> Bud. Yo, dude, what brings a groovy scientist like yourself in my humble abode at this ungodly hour? It's always the ungodly hour, guys. Yo, dude, I'm just kicking it and making my rounds around the neighborhood saying hi to everyone. How you doing? <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> hey. Hey, man, I'm just here tending to my plants, you know, enjoying the simple things in life. But I gotta ask, what's with the lab outfit? Got some experiments you of your own going on, huh? Yeah, I got some experiments of my own, but they're kind of classified. I can't really tell you here out in the open. <laughs> Maybe that will pique his curiosity, guys. The scientist is scientisting, guys. Whoa, dude, classified information, huh? That sounds intense. I respect your need for secrecy and all, but I hope it's nothing that'll mess with my garden. You know what I mean? Of course not. All my experiments happen inside my house. I'm gonna let, I'm gonna give him some reinsurance. Reinsurance, your garden is fine. But as long as it's not gonna affect my plants, I'm cool with it, man. You seem like a chill scientist unlike those uptight ones on TV. So what kind of experiments are we talking here? I can tell you more about the experiments if you invite me inside your house because I can't say too much out in the open. Let me say that. Maybe, 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 huh? Oh, yeah. Hey, all right, man, I dig your vibe, come on in. But let's keep it on the down low. You know, can't have whole neighborhoods knowing about my sketch. Okay. And... <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, this is too... Oh, what if we just like, let him be? What happens if we just kind of... Does he ever leave? No, he just, he just keeps running around in circles, what? Dude, harsh buzz. <laughs> I really like this game and how smooth like the the microphone is. Like when you talk into it, it adds punctuation and everything. And I like how like responsive and quick the AI is to respond to what you have to say. You don't have to wait too long. I really like this game. This game's actually pretty cool. Oh, come on, come on, police officer, come on, come on, police officer, you're almost here. Come on, little nightly watch, come on. Come on, come on. Dang, dang, dang. Don't get me, don't get me. Oh, oh, break ankles. Oh, snap. What's your deal, scientist? You laws are just looking for trouble. Oh, I just moved in down the street. Have you not seen me, Frank? Use their name so they know. Use their name so they know. Don't play games with me, scientist. I keep a close eye on this neighborhood and I haven't seen you around before. What's your real reason for being out here? Oh, well, I just visited my grandma. Have you seen her? <laughs> just look, act all innocent. Like, I just went, your story doesn't add up, scientists. I don't recall any reports of scientists visiting their grandmas late at night. What's the real reason you're wandering these streets? But my grandma does live down the street. I was supposed to come earlier, but I ended up coming super late because of traffic. Does that work? Does that work? Huh? Huh? You like that? Traffic, huh? I find that hard to believe, scientists. If your grandma lives here, why haven't I seen you before? And why didn't you just come during the day? She's my long-lost grandma. I just found her the other day on the internet, so I came to visit her, and it's gotten so late. There you go. That's why you haven't seen me before. Come on, stop dwelling so deeply into it. Long-lost grandma, huh? That's quite a coincidence. I'll need some proof to back up your story, scientist. Any identification or contact information for your grandma? 
Ah, I'm getting caught up. I'm getting caught up, guys. I'm sweating. I'm sweating. No, I don't have any of those. They got lost while I was in traffic. I had to leave my car behind since there was so much traffic. <laughs> <laughs> Will you believe that I lost your identification and contact information, huh? How convenient. Look, scientist, your story is falling apart. I'm giving you one last chance. Give me a straight answer before I take you down to the station. What if I said I was a vampire looking for victims? Would you believe that? <laughs> Would you? Huh? <laughs> nice try, wise guy. You just sealed your fate. You're under arrest for suspicious behavior and proving false. <gasps> really? You've been arrested. That's crazy. But yeah, guys, if this video gets popular enough and you guys want me to go ahead and see what happens if you get 31 people or the whole neighborhood, I would definitely come back in and try it out. This game is really interesting. If, if anything, I would love to try this game out more after they update some more stuff. Because as for what it is right now, it kind of gets like a little repetitive. But I see that it can get like a, little, a lot different if you wear like this outfit and they're like, oh, um, I'm working construction, you know, in the middle of the night. Because it's literally your construction. You're wearing a scientist outfit. Oh, you're a scientist. You work a DJ outfit. You're a DJ. I like that they have different choices, though. So there is a ton of repayability. I'm never looking forward to any more updates that they would have on this game. But yeah. Gonna be for me. Definitely let me know what you guys think about this game. And if you guys want me to play some more, definitely let me know. And don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Nina out.